So the link I sent you takes you to a Desmos page where you can play around with the graph of an ellipse. And they're kind of cool shapes. What I've added to this graph and you're not responsible for in this class is something called a foci, the focus. There's two of them, plural is foci. And you can play around with the shape of an ellipse like this. So you can move this out, stretch it. This is a more eccentric ellipse. That is, it's narrower and you can make B smaller. Now, there's a couple special points in here and those foci um, have some neat properties. Now, as you squeeze this out, make it narrower and narrower, those foci tend to be closer and closer to the edges of the ellipse. We actually move around the sun in an almost circular way. And the sun is actually at one focus of our elliptical shaped orbit. So our orbit's kind of like this. It looks very much like a circle and the sun is at one focus. Now, what happens if I move this, instead of B being 3.9, what if I make it exactly four? Watch what happens to the foci. Bam, they coincide. So you can see that the circle is actually a special case of an ellipse. But these foci have cool properties and somebody actually built a pool table in an elliptical shape, which is pretty cool. So let me see if I can't find that link here. There we go. There's your elliptical shape pool table. I don't know how much that would cost to build. It couldn't have been cheap. It's kind of cool. And if you put the cue ball on one focus and at the other focus is the hole, let's see if you can make a shot from pretty much anywhere. And so here he goes. You put the, the pool ball at one focus and he's gonna shoot it just anywhere at random and it should always go in. It's kind of cool. So. Get my first ever shot. <laughs> over there, over here. It will always rebound into that pocket. That is because from any point on the side, it makes the same angle to each focus point. And as you know, when you rebound something against a surface, the angle of incidence equals the angle of reflection. Whenever it is positioned on this focus point, Wherever I hit it, it will go in. You know, if it's here, wherever I rebound it, it's never going to go in. It's only when it's exactly on this dot. And so that's the theory, and that was... Now, it actually works good in theory. In practice, you have to give it the right amount of oomph. If you shoot it too hard or shoot it too soft, it won't work. But it's still pretty cool. So, any comments or thoughts or questions on that little bit? Just kind of a little something extra for fun about ellipses. No, good there? All right.